will you look at that once again UAD going for the slightly more mobile setup. Actually this is the same matchup we saw Anubis versus uh, in the Immortals. The Immortals went with uh, the lineup that officially is going with and Anubis Empire actually went with the, uh, the lineup that you are dead are going with. Yeah, yeah, that's true. And uh, already a T1 gets taken down on the uh, efficiency side. As a matter of fact, uh, you know, uh, we see Simo Miku uh, that was the first uh, shot, uh, courtesy of Captain Kunyuk mm -hmm. and his eyes. But um, essentially, it's the same tank lineup. It's just uh, wh while Gun Havoc on the efficiency side has a KV5, uh, it's Angel X uh, who was so, so good in the previous set yeah. uh, with his T69 as well. So, uh, yeah, spot more moon. Uh, a wee bit more mobility when it comes to uh, uh, the uh, team efficiency side, uh, the, sorry, the uh, UAD side. Yeah. I'm really curious as to how they're going to tackle this. Too, yeah, and, and we can already see a push actually coming out from you right there. They're sending yeah. four of the uh, tanks up the hill. It's, it's, it's accompanied by a T1 as well. So uh, not not four heavy tanks or four tier 8 tanks, but three, uh, just two heavies plus a T69. So definitely the western or the eastern side of the map definitely being uh, well monopolized well monopolized by you are dead at this point whereas the opponents i mean team efficiency they're going with a pretty standard kind of a really defensive lineup right now and i think uh since what happened in the first set they don't want like a similar situation to play out you know what they try in the first set they were extremely ambitious actually mm -hmm. they really tried to yeah, uh, yeah, spread yeah, out yeah. to the western field but the thing is they really didn't know uad was going to come up with something like that mm -hmm. much and squatting the railroad with the high ground just giving them both vision and uh, shooting angles pretty much, they got completely obliterated, which is why I think it's just a wee bit of concern and uh, th that's showing like a little bit yeah. of nerves. Right <laughs> I mean, you can't see it on your screen, but right now uh, the uh, efficiency members are clustered at their starting position. They haven't budged mm -hmm. one inch pretty much, so uh, uh, that's a testimony on how pretty much stressed they actually feel and pressured uh, by the UAD team. And, and UAD right now, as you can see it on your screen, have completely own this map already. I mean, they, they've got like uh, uh, their tanks exactly where they want them to be. Uh, the central park is is covered uh, by those two heavy tanks to the uh, uh, southeastern parts of uh, the, the the field area, uh, whereas the, the the hail has been entirely monopolized. So, right now we are actually uh, watching. Um, Team efficiency uh, concentrating their 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 forces to the west railroad, but honestly, if they go all in like this, they're gonna get punished. Yeah, definitely. So I mean, efficiency they have repositioned right here, and the thing is, since you are you are dead, do have con uh, control of the hilltop. Uh, this push could actually maybe work out if they time it correctly. If they time it, it it's correctly, it's all gonna come yeah. down to timing. Exactly, but they can't be. They can't afford to just send all their tanks out yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, no, uh, definitely not. They have to have at least one to defend or delay a possible northern base capture as mm -hmm. well. I mean, obviously they're sending quite wisely their uh, remaining T1 first, uh, just to make sure the way is clear. Uh, but uh, yeah, uh, once again, a lot of it's gonna depend on UAD. I mean, they are pushing mm -hmm. uh, right now. Just team efficiency, definitely. They're like, okay, no, we, we can't just like sit here and wait because we're going to get trapped once more so oh, they, they have been spotted, spotted. Yep. Uh, they, 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 their push has been compromised uh, yeah, they, and they, really should they should retreat yeah yeah they once they, they I mean they could go for this kill right now they haven't spotted any of the other members of UR Dead on this side of the map so potentially they are just going to continue to go for it I like also what they're doing with uh, I, I don't know if it's Deidre's or Comics but it's most likely an aim is 50 that's lagging yeah. kind of I mean it's still sort of pushing with the team but it's also lagging behind far enough just so just in case you're going to go capture. for a push. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. uh, close enough to still defend and still close enough to provide cover mm -hmm. for yep, his teammates yep. as well. So yeah, it's extremely smart. As a matter of fact, right now they're like, okay, you know, the Western Front's empty, so we might as well send the T1 back yeah. uh, just yeah, 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 to yeah. Uh, get eyes on our own base. I think that's very, very well done. And it's going uh, especially help that defending AMX uh, exactly. just in case. Yeah. Exactly. So uh, no, no, the MX-50 right there in the middle is quite safe. And actually. it can provide cover fire on, exactly. the, on the southern Onto, part of the field. Uh, I know, it's very mm -hmm. smart. I'm actually really liking this move by Team Efficiency, but it's been a while we didn't get oh, eyes on target, like yeah, yeah. Uh, so uh, it most likely it looks like uh, UAD have, have come back like to defend this pretty much. It yeah, looks yeah, like yeah. it. Yeah, uh, pretty much well there. Uh, if efficiency don't reposition right now, they could be in a little bit of trouble because you are dead. Are gonna go for the surrounding maneuver right now and, they are and going the for base the, capture yeah, uh, of, uh, by themselves. And I think they, they committed both T ones up there, so uh, uh, or possibly even one heavy tank. Yeah, uh, yeah, definitely. I so think they're just like split their forces because they know that just as long as they have captured the northern base, uh, even though they get all their tanks like destroyed to the south, it's not gonna matter. I'm gonna I, have to I, say this is most likely gonna go in favor of you are dead yeah. just because uh, it's going to be extremely easy for you are dead to defend this uh, base going on. Well, no, I mean, you know what? They can lose tanks. It doesn't matter if Actually, they lose tanks. Actually, it also could end in a tie. 
<laughs> it, 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 both base captures happen. Because yeah. uh, uh, actually, the base capture, the thing when these base captures happen. Oh, but look at that. Only eight seconds, seconds left. Only eight seconds left. It's just one shot's going to be enough to delay uh -oh. this, though. One shot will be enough to delay this. And it looks uh -oh. like. Oh, are you are dead? Actually, it's going to be a tie. No, UAD got this. Wow.